Curious about the Forest Hills Public School District here in Grand Rapids, Michigan? Well, I'm here to break it down for you here on Living in Grand Rapids. Hi everybody, my name is Josh May with May Group Realtors, Remax of Grand Rapids, and I am excited to chat Forest Hills, the Forest Hills Public School District. In fact, this is the district I know a ton about because my office is in Forest Hills, my house is in Forest Hills, and I've been cruising the streets of Forest Hills and running around these schools for over two decades, so let's get into it. So. The cool thing about the area is it's a very, very large geographical area. In fact, Forest Hills is considered one of the largest geographical areas as far as school goes, schools go in the state of Michigan. Okay, so a little bit of history. In 1956, there was 18 one-room schoolhouses in this large area, which is 68 square miles. They combined all of those schools to create the Forest Hills School District. Okay. Now, since uh, that population has grown, the district is up over 10,000 students, and they've been able to remain uh, and focus on a small classroom size while they've grown. So the student population classroom size is still at a less than a 25 to one ratio, 25 students to one uh, teacher. And since the district, and since there was obviously so many students, since there's such a large geographical area, it's been split into three schools within the Forest Hills School District. I'm gonna start at the top. You've got Forest Hills Eastern, which we're gonna get into all the schools in Forest Hills Eastern. And then you've got Forest Hills Northern, which is the smallest district within the district. And then you've got Forest Hills Central, which is in the central to southern portion of Forest Hills. So we're gonna break down all these districts. We're also gonna get into some specialty schools, some immersion programs. We're gonna talk about the Forest Hills Fine Arts Center. We're gonna talk about athletics. So let's get into it. So as mentioned, the Forest Hills School System is a very large area. In fact, there's 18 schools within this larger geographical area. And the district is divided into three different school systems. And I wanna start with Forest Hills Eastern, okay? Now Forest Hills Eastern, the Hawks. Now this is the largest geographical area within the Forest Hills School System. It's on the north side of the district and I want to talk about rankings, right? So this is why people move to Forest Hills is because they want a highly ranked public school system and Forest Hills Eastern ranks number 29 in the entire state of Michigan as far as the education system. So great schools, really it's a newer, newer uh, district so you're going to get some newer buildings, really nice uh, facilities. Um, I want to mention there's, there's two elementary schools in Forest Hills Eastern. You've got Orchard View on the north side, and then you've got um, Nat Forest, which is right in the middle of the district. And then you head out and you will find the Forest Hills Middle School, along with the Forest Hills High School. This is where all the athletic programs are. It's a beautiful, beautiful campus at the corner of Knapp and Pettus Street. Okay, so moving on to Forest Hills Northern, the Huskies of Forest Hills Northern, near and dear to my heart. We've got a couple children in the Northern District right now. And this is actually the smallest geographical area. It's kind of right in the middle to the west side of the district. And as far as uh, schools within the district, they've got two elementary schools, which you've got Meadowbrook on the south side of Northern, and then you've got uh, Collins Elementary right in the middle there. Uh, you've got Northern Trails, which is the fifth and sixth grade campus. This is off Leonard Street and you've got Northern Middle School, and then you've got Northern uh, High School, all on the same campus. So a beautiful facility. Again, newer uh, buildings along with uh, athletic facilities and just really top of the line. So I uh, want to take a step back because I did not mention the rankings of Forest Hills Northern. Comes in at number 21 uh, public school in the entire state of Michigan. So again, all of these districts are ranked very high from an education standpoint. So that gives you a little bit of insight on Forest Hills Northern. All right, so let's move on to Forest Hills Central, our third district within the district. Forest Hills Central, the Rangers. Now this is the second largest area, right? So you've got Eastern being the largest, you've got Central being the middle, 
and then you've got Northern being the smallest geographical area. But uh, Central is really located in the central portion of the district, stretches all the way to the south. Now, as far as the rankings go, again, common theme here, coming in at number 28 in the entire state of Michigan as far as public schools go. So we've got 29, 28, 21. That's pretty cool as far as the Forest Hills Public School District goes. Now, in Forest Hills Central, you've got three elementary schools. You've got Thornapple Elementary, you've got Ada Elementary, and then you've got Pine Ridge. And then, uh, similar to Northern, you've got a fifth and sixth grade campus, which is Central Woodlands, uh, right off of Ada Drive, in between Ada and Hall Street. And then again, you've got a beautiful middle school and high school campus, all in the same area. Top of the line athletic facilities. Uh, location is really right in the center of Forest Hills. So that is a little bit of information on Forest Hills Central, the Rangers. So next up, I wanna highlight some of the specialty schools and immersion programs that Forest Hills Public Schools offer. And I know a ton about this because some of my kids are in these programs right now. And I wanna start with Ada Vista, the Spanish Immersion Program. What a great, great school. And this is located essentially in the heart of Ada, but then filters into Forest Hills Northern. And Another immersion program that Forest Hills offers is the Chinese Mandarin program, another highly acclaimed school that is within the Meadowbrook Elementary School that again filters into Northern. So you've got two awesome immersion programs, Spanish, Chinese Mandarin, and both highly, highly acclaimed in the area. Okay, so a specialty school that I really want to highlight is Good Willie Environmental School. Now this is a school that's near and dear to me because my sixth grade daughter goes there and she absolutely loves it. It's such a cool school. It's just two grades, fifth and sixth grade. It's off of Two Mile and Honey Creek and it really uh, teaches kids how to work in the environment on a daily basis. I mean, I love this school. I drop my daughter off and she literally walks through the woods every single day to get to her classroom and it's an amazing experience for these kids. So just want to spend a little bit of time on the immersion opportunities and the specialty school that Forest Hills offers. Next, I want to briefly mention the Forest Hills Fine Arts and the opportunities that are given to these children within the district. There's 43 dedicated fine art teachers within the district focusing on all the fine arts, obviously choir and band and music and uh, theater and you name it. And what's really cool about the fine arts is the Forest Hills Fine Art Center, which is a class A state of the art designated theater and uh, fine art center for performances. Been there many, many times watching my kids. And that is a very nice highlight within the district. Okay, so we've touched a bit on education, rankings, geographical locations, schools, fine arts, immersion programs, specialty schools. I want to wrap things up with talking about athletics. So Forest Hills offers a wide variety of athletic programs and club sports for students. And I'm just going to run through the list here. Obviously, you've got the main staples. You've got basketball, you've got football, you've got volleyball, you've got track and field, you've got cross country opportunities. You've got swimming, diving, you've got a great water polo program, you've got tennis, you've got ice hockey, you've got golf, you have bowling, of course, competitive cheer, you've got sideline cheer, you've got gymnastics, you've got wrestling, and one of my favorites, you've got skiing. So endless opportunities for children to get in, involved in athletics and club sports. So I absolutely hope you've learned something today. Again, this district is absolutely amazing. And we'd love it if you'd comment on some of the things that you love about the Forest Hills Public Schools. And of course, don't forget to make sure you hit the like button. Absolutely hammer that subscribe button. We want to bring you the content every single week. And we'll see you next week. Have a great one.